Let's look at mortality. We never looked at that. And you know what? Mortality is 2.5 greater in the patients taking levothyroxine with hypothyroidism. We just we know this. that retrospectively, yes, obviously. Retrospectively. Now, that's a really, really interesting observation, and of course, a very provocative one because it it raises a question, right? Which is, is this two and two and a half fold increase in mortality? Mm -hmm. Now, I don't think levothyroxine is doing anything bad. I think that. It's restoring your thyroidism in an incomplete fashion. Because what are these patients dying of in this study? Yeah. We know that they die of cardiometabolic diseases. They have increased cholesterol. Uh, so the number one co-medication that is prescribed with levothyroxine is statin. statin. So we are not restoring, as you know, cholesterol goes up in patients with hypothyroidism, yep. but does it go back to normal after uh, the TSH has been normalized? Answer, no. We have to give statin to ensure that the cholesterol remains. Okay. What you're saying, which I did not know, by the way, and that's why I want to restate it, just because you fix TSH and T3 and free T3 in the periphery, which is what you're measuring, you may not have fixed it in the liver, and therefore you may still have ineffective LDL clearance. That's, th yes, but we, do, we don't fix T3 or free T3. We fix, we fix TSH. it indirectly. Yes, 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 yes. What we do is we fix TSH, we fix free T4, we think we fix T3. But we don't know we don't that know. for a fact. Yep. And the liver in the rats, I, we did these studies, the liver remained hypothyroid. We measure a lot of enzymes and genes in the liver. And as a result, well, wh what happens in the clinic? A patient comes, oh, your t cholesterol is slightly elevated. I'll give you statin. Number one co-medication with levothyroxine.